Hello, this is Sky Factory episode 6, and in today's video, we get infinite diamonds. Well, technically. Watch till the end to see what I mean. This is an episode of a series where me and my friend make a world out of one block and one tree. And if you haven't seen the other episodes yet, it's right here in the top right corner of the screen. Anyway, enjoy the video. Also, subscribe for a cookie because cookies are good. I'm sorry for the audio in advance. First of all, because you could not hear Blob's microphone at all. And my microphone made a lot of popping noises for some reason. But because I still want to make this video good for you guys, I'll be voiceovering Blob's voice like this. So if you ever hear this voice, this is Blob. Hey, what's going on guys? It's Dewey here. We're back in another video. And in today's video, we are in Sky Factory. And, uh, um, I've been just a little busy between episodes, and could you, could you, um, uh, th thanks for that, thanks for that, I really needed that. Um, Blob, come over here. So over here, I have something, and yeah, this might look kind of crazy, but what I want, what I want you to do- Why? Ju uh, jump in here. J jump in there. Jump in. Th just jump. Jump in there. No, in there. no, no. I jump in there. Jump in there. No, no. Jump in there. No. <laughs> Why did you get over? You just flew. You just flew. You went from here to all the way over here. Okay, go in. Go in. Go in. Go in. Go in. The jump is not that hard. Go in. See, I made it. <laughs> Good for you, Blob. <laughs> jump, jump in. Jump in. Jump in. You get in. Ow. Yeah. How? How are you hitting me? Get in. Um, Get in. Why are um, you taking zero knockback? <laughs> <laughs> There's just a little bit of latency. Oh, I accidentally fell. I need a I need a proper send off. Okay, okay. Seeker's Construct Smeltery, if you didn't know. And, um, if you check in here, we have, uh, blood, and then there's your statue. You can grab that. But look what we can do with your blood. Um, um, is that a ball? Coagulated, congla- I don't even know how to say it. Coagulated. Coagulated blood. <laughs> <laughs> okay, good. Wait, I'll just make it. Oh no, why thought you hit me? So now, if you check this chest, there is more congagulated, coagulated blood, glass, and gold. So now, what we're gonna do, if you look in the crafting station, uh, improved fluid thing, we can make improved fluid pipe. So now we have uh, this thingy. Th this makes power out of lava. Oh, okay. So. In theory, if I take water, no, 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 we, we, great. Um, in theory, if we put this, l take the lava out, and then, boom, boom. Wait, okay, so wait. Um. Okay, I just, I just took it out. This is a fluid hopper, and the theory was that it's gonna take the lava into the converter to make power. So... It works, but it's not automated. I, I just decided to put in a bucket of lava in there just to see what would happen. And, um, it turned it into power. No! Oh my gosh, I found it! I found the mod pack! Yes! Alright, anyway, continuing on, on with the tutorial, we can make stone bricks with smelting cobblestone to get stone. And then we can turn those into stone brick stairs. And then we can make energy cables. And then boom, we have energy cables and 16 of them. So now I'm going to make bricks out of the 
I can make bricks out of the brick that we make from smelting clay. We turn that into bricks and then we can make brick stairs. We have eight of those. And then we need, um, uh, eight gold nuggets. So now we get the, oh, what? Where did you come from? What? What? How does a zombie here? We have this whole- WHY DID they GIVE ME A CARROT? Hey, we have a carrot to now farm with. Oh, we already had some. Okay, anyway, we put in the gold, and then the bricks. And then we have a fluid cable! So now we have both the cables. Um, wait, I need the wrench. Oh, okay, yeah. We make this wrench by doing this simple recipe. From there, we can use this wrench to um hmm where is all this lava going to it works chat we did it we did it let's go okay so if i take some water and i take some lava if i go to my waffle Put one lava, one water, triple compressed cobblestone, cobblestone on each side, block of redstone, redstone on each side, and glass. We have a cobble gen tier 2, which that's a tier 1. So what I'm actually going to do, because I only need a tier 1, I'm going to break this. And then I'm going to replace it with the tier 2. So now we have a tier 2 for our like actual cobblestone storage. And then I'm going to... Then I'm going to put a wooden hopper right here. And then I'm going to put a, the cobblestone right there. So then, yes, this is going to start filling up with cobblestone. And then the cobblestone is going to start melting from the lava beneath it, turning that into lava. The lava is going to go through this pipe into here. This is going to turn it into power. And in theory, if I put the pulverizer down, have the energy pump into the pulverizer now if i get my wrench out go like that and it doesn't work it's working oh my gosh it's working oh my gosh let's go yes Okay, just for testing, I'm gonna break this and the hopper. And what I'm gonna do with them is put the hopper feed into that. We have the cobblestone generator. Boom. So now this is gonna get cobblestone. Auto input from the side. Oh! Oh! Look! Look! It's making noises! Let's go! Yes! Okay, so... Alright, okay, so this changes a lot. So, now, let me explain this. Cobblestone getting generated from this. Going into the hopper, into the crucible. The crucible is heating up the cobblestone, burning it, turning it into lava. The lava gets shot down this pipe, all the way into this. This cr turns the lava into power. The power gets thrown out, in, out of these... Um, out into these energy cables into this which powers this pulverizer this pulverizer takes the co um gets cobblestone from this uh what you might call it calls gen and puts it from the hopper into the pulverizer which pulverizes it into dust and sand and all that good stuff so the next part of the automation process requires something called a click machine and actually we were supposed to use this a while ago like this is some, like a big big part of automating and it's apparently just gonna click for you so yes i'm a bit of an idiot and a lot of this could have been way easier and avoided but what are you gonna do it's a pretty cheap recipe too so i might just do that now Okay, so we need to put redstone, redstone, iron in between. We get this redstone servo. We, uh, piston. Actually, I don't know if that's on that. I think it's in the middle. Ten. Oh, there it is. Click machine. So now if I put, like, the click machine. Wait, right there. 
need to face that way. Okay, so now it's clicking on that. Okay, so now if I get some lava, put it in there, water. We are obsidian! Okay, so that's good. Alright, so now we need to do that three more times. Okay, so now we have four obsidian. Okay, but with the obsidian, we should be able to take a pearl. Go like this. Make it like a, um, whatever it's called. And then we make an I basic item collector. Okay, we need a double chest. What? Um, I accidentally right-clicked the water with the sand? Sea water? What? I mean, Blob's gonna come up and be like, why is this one different? And I'll be like, uh, I don't know. <laughs> this. Now, but, okay, so now when I hover over this, it shows a box. And what this actually does, a basic item collector, it's literally in the name. It just collects items, just loose items. So right now, it, but I need it to collect all items from the sieve because that's the objective. We're trying to automate items from the sieve. So, hovering over this, we need to expand, uh, okay, wait, I don't know, does that expand it? Okay, so now, this is gonna pick up anything from the sieves, it's gonna throw it into the chest, we turn it into actual bricks, turn it into more brick stairs, we've done this before, put four in each corner, put four in nuggets, the iron nuggets this time, and now we have item cable instead of all the other cables rainbow magic okay back we want the output okay no what wait what east gravel Okay, so it's auto sieving gravel. Now watch. Look! It just sieved. And look! Oh my gosh! It's working! Okay, so we're gonna mine these sieves. Fill this row up with. Fill this row back up with that. Bam. Look! And now we have more. Okay guys, that's gonna be the end of this video, but before I finish, I'm going to explain all this to you guys. So, we start off our journey by uh, um, pumping cobblestone into the crucible. The crucible heats up the cobblestone, turns it into lava. The lava gets shot out, this blue pipe gets put into this uh, mag ma magmatic dynamio, and it takes lava and turns it into energy. The energy is, gets pumped into the pulverizer, which um, has the energy and also has cobblestone being fueled by this cobblestone generator. So now this cobblestone is getting pulverized into gravel and sand and sometimes, yeah, sand. And then we get, oh, it gets pull, put all the way um, into these item, item cables, gets put into this... A click machine and this click machine um, auto sieves it for us and then it auto sieves it and this uh, basic item collector collects the all those items throws them into the chest and in theory we have infinite and I mean infinite diamonds um, all of this is automated completely automated anyway while the rain goes I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please do like and subscribe. It's helped me a ton to me, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye!